All right, um, this is going to be my space cam uh, because I'm just going to film my space until the battery dies on us and it runs out. This is live action at Columbus, the flea market, um, for the next however long this lasts. If it lasts five minutes, you're going to get five minutes of video. If it lasts an hour, you're going to get an hour of video. I'm just going to set it and forget it. Here goes. I don't even know what I'm filming or what I'm getting in here. But. That ought to be the space. I can see from the other side. All right. But I'm calling my set it and forget it cam. This is still working, but I figured I'd put those um, quilt tops and that quilt up there. At least somebody might notice them. Whatever. I'm going to sell them cheap. Everything's pretty cheap today. If, they're, if they make me an offer. $34 so far. I think that's a good angle. I can't see the back. So. Anything priced, I'll work with you.
Nothing in the boxes, I'm just selling the boxes. Ten dollars, two for fifty. I bought a bicycle as well. <laughs> That's who I was leaning towards, though. Maybe Toga. I'm working, so... Fenton had a way of doing it, and then and then once they got where they were doing QVC, they started writing all over everything, and you know. Well, I mean, they were going down anyway, so I guess they were trying anything to, you know what I mean? I mean, they're gone now, so whatever they did didn't work, you know. Fenton's out of business. Uh, several years ago, we're sure they're not producing any more glass. 
it was like they had a little bit of a rush, um, and I got their name out there again when they were doing the QVC stuff. And they were doing uh, some of the stuff was really nice that they did from QVC. Oh, yeah. 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 But a lot of more or artists. You, yeah. 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 I, but, um, they're gone now for sure. Really? Yeah. Hundred percent. Several years. I'm not 100% because stuff happens and then time passes and you kind of forget how long it's been. But it, it's more than a couple of years for sure. It could have been five years. You know? They just, they tried to... Uh, I went out to their, you know, the company and all that stuff. Yeah, part of it, it is that... Uh, on some of it. Um, you know what stuff seems to do well? Either the really antique Fenton or if you're patient, the stuff that's signed. You know, like, I, believe it or not, you know those little teeny um, uh, bird and animal things that are this big? Yeah, they hold. They'll hold value. Yeah, I, I, Some of the signs. Um, and, you know, I don't spot them. Uh, no, you don't see that. You know. And I should, you know. I mean, they're probably not around. There's probably not that much. Probably down south, right? No. Here. Right here. Yeah. Uh, I'm not a retail. I'm not a big So you just collected and whatever you saw that was a good price. And you know, I searched the place. Okay. And I don't buy anymore unless it's a really good Sure. But I don't blame I do you. Have the color now, that's a little different. I, I display that as much as I can. I collect. Unless it's a super rare. I collect myself contemporary signed American uh, glass. But I don't really do Fenton because there's too much of it, and I'd wind up with too big a collection, right? Um, I used to do like Murano, but Murano was too easy to find. So I said, I'll make it difficult on myself. So, and this stuff only goes back to, say, like the 60s and 70s. And I'm not doing Scandinavian, anything like that. I'm just doing contemporary signed American. And I probably got about 100 or so pieces. Yeah, but I'm like you. I'm not displaying them. They're like... I mean, if you pick one spot and you just rotate your pieces, then, uh, yeah, that's that's kind of a lot. Yeah, that's kind of could be a museum. Of course, yeah. I'm like, I don't even. Yeah. <laughs> Personally, like multicolor. All right. I, I, I That's actually better if it's Fenton. I think right. if someone asks you, I would say that you should Fenton yeah. or. I would say it's, I don't it's, think it's Fenton. Uh, you don't think it's who? It's Pilgrim? Okay. I'll take your word for it because. Okay. And they have the same kind of like uh, for Fenton. Yeah, so Fenton wasn't always cheap with the glass. Their cheap was already kind of heavy. Yeah. But again, it was this was made by the Okay, I, I believe it. You know, it, you always get that crossover stuff. You know, where it's just you're not sure. Right. They make right. And they would sell the land, stuff like that. Selling them four dollars or three for ten. Thank you. Bye. And you and good luck to you too.
I wonder if you're still working. I just was talking to a lady about Fender. So maybe uh, you learned something. Who's that lamp over there? The cranberry one. I don't know if you care. I'll just turn this. So if you can see, there's a cranberry lamp over there. The one thing about this camera, there's no way to really tell if it's recording. What I'll do is maybe I'll restart it and see if it's even dead. No, it looks like it is recording. glasses. It's got a little light that says. Oh. You know what, let me turn it off and restart it.